Chloe, are you okay? Sorry, I just keep thinking about shooting Frank in the leg. Please don't. You saved us. Frank is lucky. We have to keep moving forward. I better focus on this board and start tying these clues together. <sighs> Können wir noch mit Chloe labern? Hey Max, see if you can put together all those Rubik's clues. Just holla if you need any info while I go online to make sure we haven't missed anything. Okay, dann kümmern wir, jetzt, kümmern wir uns jetzt wirklich darum. Oh, okay. Moment, wie funktioniert das jetzt? Gather info on a character by selecting all the correct clues for each section. Let's look at Frank's drug deals during the week of the party. Shit! Mm. Ja, genau. Ach so. Frank's account book. But the client names are encrypted. Ja, und dafür können wir das hier nehmen. Frank is for sure the local dealer, but I, I doubt Rachel was carrying nee. drugs for him. Right? Hm, kann durchaus sein, wenn die so dicke waren. Rot must stand for Rottweiler. That does fit Nathan. Run. Okay, zu viele hiervon kennen wir nicht. Okay, wenn wir jetzt das Account Book mit dem Dingens verbinden, aber erstmal will ich den Rest mir angucken. There's no doubt she loved him in Ach so. some way. Ja gut, die, die Fotos, die kennen wir ja alle schon und alles. Die gucke ich jetzt nicht nochmal an. The game is on. Now, talk to us, account book. Tell us everything. Okay, wir haben das. Aber jetzt will ich mich erstmal um Davids Clues kümmern. Thanks to David's own investigation, I should be able to find out what Nathan did during the party's week. I hope in this case that David has good tracking skills. Okay, hier haben wir Koordinaten. Können wir vielleicht das und das hier verbinden? Oh, drei brauchen wir. Ähm, was könnte passen? David really has been on Rachel's ass for a while. She should have been upset. Andererseits, ich weiß es nicht. Hm. Maybe he was trying to help Kate. In his own messed up way. Does David know what's going on with Rachel, or is he just paranoid about everybody? Hmm. Ja, wir wollen ja Nathan wissen. Ich weiß nicht, was ich hier jetzt auswählen soll. Oh, no. This is not working. Na gut, wir lassen das hier erstmal noch und ich schaue mir stattdessen Nathan's Sachen an. What could help me unlock this phone? There's a lot of numbers in here. Ba, 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 ba. Das haben wir auch schon mal irgendwann gelesen. Ich glaube nicht, dass da irgendwas davon ist. If there is a dark room, we better find it. It's a good thing Chloe slipped all these files on her flash drive. Sieht auch nicht aus, als würden wir daher ein Passwort bekommen. This is the Vortex Club party where Nathan drugged Kate. Okay. Did he do the same thing to Rachel at another party? Das ist. Holy shit. Nathan is seriously unhinged. But those numbers might be useful. Ja, ich glaube, hier sind wir auf der richtigen Spur. Couldn't hurt to give this pin code a whack. Ne, ich glaube, wir nehmen das hier. Und vier? Okay, ich schätze mal, da muss ich gleich doch eher erst zurück zu den äh, Sachen, die wir schon hingekriegt haben. 
Wieso wähle ich das jetzt aus? Was müssen wir denn hier vier Sachen auswählen? Looks like this is not relevant at all. Ja, das dachte ich mir. Okay, wir gucken erstmal das hier an. Let's see if I can find any deal Frank made with Nathan or the Vortex Club. Oh Mann, das wird komplex. Das ist immer noch. Ja, okay. Remember these names and see how Nathan fits in with all this. Nathan, Rod. Wir suchen nach Rod, wie es aussieht. Nein, das wollte ich nicht. Frank sure is keeping his customers satisfied. He could open a store. Ach, ähm, wisst ihr was? Wozu gibt's Schmierpapier? So, das heißt, Rod war am 30.09. Um 22 Uhr in Blackwell. Was auch immer die anderen Sachen da heißen. Weiter im Text. Ah Mist, jetzt müssten wir eigentlich wissen, wann die Vortex klappt. Ne, müssen wir das? Egal, ich schaue erstmal alles durch. Everybody in Arcadia Bay must be high. That explains a lot. So. German Shepherd. <lacht> ähm, hier ist Rod nicht dabei. Nein. If Frank applied this kind of detail to his life, who am I to talk? Alter, Namen sind das. Ach so, ein Gramm, zwei Gramm. Ja, manchmal bist du blöd, Tim. Ähm, hier ist Rod auch nicht dabei. Dafür müssen wir das deselecten und können das hier schon mal auswählen. Hm. Two deals with Nathan on the same day? Party supplies, no doubt. Das war der. Wo haben wir denn zweimal Rod? Ach, da! Das war der vierte, zehnte. Wieso schreibe ich mir das eigentlich auf? Wahrscheinlich müssen wir eh nur darauf achten, auf welchen Teilen Rod alles dabei war. I'm getting a contact high just reading this. Kein Rod. I wonder what dog name Frank would have given me. Hm. Da ist ein Rod. Sogar zwei Rods. Sogar drei Rods. Wunderbar, ich glaube, wir haben unsere drei. Oh, yes. These are all the times and places for Frank and Nathan's deals. Ach so, ja, cool. Ähm, Scheiße. Was genau brauchen wir hier jetzt? Wir müssen wissen. Was wollen wir wissen? Ich schätze mal, die Bilder helfen uns nicht wahnsinnig weiter. Ich mache jetzt einfach mal zufällig. Looks like David was tracking somebody's car. Maybe even Nathan's. Good clue. Ja, aber das ist nicht das, was wir suchen. Damn. I, I must have missed something. Was willst du? Looks like this isn't the right combination. I'll have to analyze these plates and coordinates to see if Nathan was under David's surveillance. Spy the us. Okay, Moment. Ich muss die. 
Let's get now. Thanks to David's own investigation, I should be able to find out what Nathan did during the party's week. Das hier brauchen wir auf jeden Fall, da bin ich mir ziemlich sicher. DWMPKS, ist das das hier? Look at all these license plates. I hope he was tailing Nathan. Okay, ne, aber das sieht schon mal gut aus. Und dann... Vielleicht? Max, there is no logical link between those clues. <lacht> Schade. <lacht> Oder war der hier vielleicht? At least David was finally going after the right suspect. David should have done way more than take photos of Kate. 3.17 Uhr Blackwell Parking. Und wir hier irgendwo. Nee. Und ich schätze mal, das ist das Nummernschild, oder nicht? Twin Peaks. Fail. Abort. Wrong clues. Ich lasse das hier erstmal. I have to analyze Nathan's messages. What could help me unlock this phone? Oh, there has got to be some good shit in his phone. I just need the code to unlock it. Okay, das Phone brauchen wir auf jeden Fall. Hm. Die vier hier hatten wir schon mal, oder? Better look for any clues or numbers that could be his pen code. Ja, okay. Das sieht ich glaube nicht, dass es hier drin war. Vielleicht hier? Fail. Abort. Wrong clues. No. This is not working. Im Gegensatz zu dem oben mit, mit Frank habe ich hier keinen Plan, was ich tun soll. Ich meine, wir müssen ja vier auswählen. Wenn ich das... Handy einfach mal weglasse. I wonder if there's any important dates or numbers in the school file. Ist das ein Tipp? Ich meine, die haben wir doch ausgewählt. Vielleicht das dann weniger. Was ist das hier? Oh, so busted. It's good to see the Prescotts can't cover up all their tracks. Dear Mr. and Mrs. Prescott, we regret to inform you that Nathan Prescott has disrupted various classes over the past month despite repeated warnings and leniency. Due to a crude outburst at Mrs. Hoyda's. Kennen wir das nicht schon? Ich bin mir ziemlich sicher, dass wir das schon mal gelesen haben. Und das wird keinen, keine Aussage über sein Passwort geben. Da bin ich mir ziemlich sicher. Die beiden könnten was sein. Das könnte was sein. Nope. Maybe I should try to link other clues together. Gute Idee, Max. Aber welche verdammt? Looks like this isn't the right combination. <lacht> Boah, was ist das denn? Chloe, findest du noch irgendwas? We've printed everything we need. Now it's time to focus on the big board. Hey Max, see if you can put together all those Rubik's clues. Just holla if you need any info while I go online to make sure we haven't missed anything. Hier können wir auch nichts auswählen. Nur die beiden. Ach Mann. Max, I know we can snap all these pieces together. Roger that. 
I'm going to study the board and try to connect all these dots. Did our plan have to include shooting Frank in the leg? Wäre echt schön gewesen, wenn es nicht gewesen und nicht passiert wäre. Ach Mann! Of course, I'm a suspect. <laughs> Proving David sucks as a detective. Sorry. Ich frage mich halt, ob irgendwas mit diesen Twin Peaks zu tun hat. Aber da helfen uns die Fotos nicht weiter. Was ist das hier? You need to get rid of these damn cameras, David. Nee. Okay, also die Fotos helfen uns nicht weiter, schätze ich. Das hier sollte uns weiterhelfen. Was ist das genau? Das hilft uns, glaube ich, auch nicht so wirklich. Ich nehme mal. I'll have to analyze these plates and coordinates to see if Nathan was under David's surveillance. Spies are us. Ich weiß, was ich machen soll. Aber nicht wie. And that's all she wrote. Ah! Please let me find some clues about Nathan in here. Okay. Interessant. Great. Now, how do I find out which car is Nathan's to match the coordinates? Nee, ich will es immer nie nur anschauen. Of course Nathan drives an SUV. Overcompensating, as usual. Wir suchen ein... Wir wissen auf jeden Fall, dass der rote Jeep von ihm ist. Und das war Twilight Zone. Das heißt, wir suchen nach Twilight yep. Zone. Another car David was tracking. Nein. Huh. Who else Nein. Was David tracking here? Nein. Why the hell are you following these people? And to where? Okay, der hier. Und ich wähle jetzt einfach mal die beiden hier aus. Fail. Abort. Wrong clues. Schade. Okay, was sieht man hier genau? Hm. Who does oh. this car belong to? Alles klar. Interesting. Is this Nathan's car? Das heißt, wir müssen das hier und das hier auswählen. Come on. To do Nathan's license plate number, then match it up with the coordinates. Ernsthaft? Twilight Zone. Oder ist das... Oh, vielleicht ist... Moment, jetzt muss ich... Ach, genau, wartet mal. Hier, seht ihr, seht ihr das hier? Ich war blind. Ja, okay. Dann haben wir das so. Und so. Und, ähm... Genau, was war das hier? SC bla bla bla. Der hier? Ja. Perfekt. Oh yes, now we're finally getting somewhere. <coughs> Chloe, let's plug in these numbers and see if they lead to an actual address. Aye aye, Captain. Here we come, Rachel. Ja, sehr schön. <lacht> Was machen wir hiermit jetzt? Oh Gott. Ich habe doch keine Ahnung. Das Handy auf jeden Fall. sagen die Nummern. Nach nein, komm. Vielleicht kann man die Nummern mit dem Gemahle irgendwie in Verbindung bringen. Nee, daraus kriegt man noch nichts. Ich glaube, das kann ich vergessen. Vielleicht das hier. Und dann 
das noch? Okay, Max. Ah. Let's blow this code up and go home. Ich dachte irgendwie, ich hätte die Kombi schon. So glad you're working with me on this. <lacht> Was hat der uns jetzt geschrieben? Okay. Nichts wirklich Tragisches. Ich frage mich, was da passiert wäre, wenn er komplett am Arsch gewesen wäre, wenn wir Warren weiter hätten kämpfen lassen. Okay. Ich will immer noch nicht so viel lesen, deshalb wird eine zukünftige Version von mir euch das hier vorlesen. Ich blätter jetzt hier nur durch. So after getting the inside info and assist from the other members of our team, Chloe and I made our way to the boys dorm aka Nathan's lair. Chloe stood guard out in the hall, and I stealthed my way into Nathan's room. And even though I've become a master spy and detective, I still get surprised by things I see or find. Like Nathan's sleek, expressionist bro cave. It was like walking from light to shadow in a single step. I swear I could feel the temperature drop the second I walked in. But then, Nathan knows photography, and he knows you have to keep the film and equipment chilled. But then, Nathan knows photography, and he knows you have to keep the film and equipment chilled. I store my instant film hoard in Mr. Jefferson's classroom. Speaking of cold stuff, Nathan's room was layered in creepy shit. The disturbing but impressive photos, all the evidence from his father's bullying, and probably the most important clue we could ever find. Nathan's phone, likely loaded with messages and mysteries. It's not a good thing that I've internalized spying and stealing so casually over the past week. Everyday hero, am I right? And that's when Nathan Prescott showed up. He looked so wild-eyed and out of control that I felt a twinge of sympathy that he clearly needed help. But then I remembered he was also an asshole and had been extremely dangerous to me, Chloe and Kate. So before I had to rewind, Warren entered the scene and my white knight headbutted Nathan in perfect payback. I couldn't believe it. Neither could Nathan. In fact, Warren literally started to go ape all over Nathan's face. It wasn't cool, but my nerves were so frayed over the week and I was so over all the Blackwell bullies that I almost didn't want to stop Warren from beating Nathan into the floor. Warren has his own issues to work out with Nathan, but this wasn't the time or place. Even if Nathan deserved it, and I would have been happy to watch Warren show him who was a Blackwell boss now. After the dorm brawl, Chloe and I headed to the beach to deal with Frank and see if we could get him to join us. Unfortunately, Frank was not in a helping mood. He went ballistic and attacked Chloe. She shot him in the leg, which totally freaked me out, even though I feel I've been seeing Chloe get shot all week. All I could think was, this is really happening. I'm outside an RV in a gunfight with a drug dealer. So our mission to bring Frank on board was impossible. Now he's even more pissed off at Chloe, and me. Part of me thinks he has the right since we shot him in the leg, but the other part thinks that Frank would be shot at some point by someone else. He should be lucky it was by us dorks. I hope his leg is okay and we don't end up with worse karma. This is not how I wanted our visit to go. And I don't want Chloe to beat herself up even more over what happened. She did defend me. <sighs> But we do have bigger Franks to fry. Or fuck up. Onward. My life feels so surreal at this point. I don't know how to react anymore. I can rewind time and space, but is it aging me before my own time and space? Am I learning things I shouldn't, messing up too much shit, including my own history? Obviously my nosebleeds and dizzy spells are a bad sign that I'm overusing my powers, but it's become almost part of my nature, or maybe a habit. Power corrupts? Not yet. I hope. I remember this famous episode of the original Star Trek where Kirk has to go back in time and let the person he loves die so the Nazis won't win the war. What kind of fucked up choice is that? What would have happened if I had not been in the school bathroom to save Chloe that day? But damn it, I was there and thus was I supposed to be there. Destiny. So things got a bit out of hand with Frank, but honestly, what else could we expect? 
He's not really our everyday hero type, and it was probably stupid from us to hope for a change, but hey, we had to confront him. We tried to persuade him we were on the same side, but it was a waste of time. We eventually had to defend ourselves and hurt him in the leg, but despite the rage in his eyes, he somehow gave us what we were looking for. He was on the verge of unleashing hell on us, but I think we've avoided the worst. I just hope our paths won't cross again anytime soon. I still don't know why Chloe or even Rachel would want to hang out with Frank, but I can't suss that out anymore. Maybe if I hadn't left town, I'd be less judgmental, but I definitely don't see the good in him. Anyhow, we tried, right? And now we have Nathan's phone, David's coordinates, Frank's account book, and a big board of clues. Which brings us closer to finding Rachel Ember. Finally. Not done. Let's start hacking. Ich wette, es sind nur. Konnte ich das gerade nicht auswählen? Ah, okay, Moment. 0058. Nee, warte, 542. Versuchen wir es mal mit 542. Ach, schade. Hm, 9988, wer weiß. Dann halt so. 9, 9, 8, 8. Ups, bad code. Uh, hoffentlich dürfen wir jetzt nicht nur dreimal. Naja, es gibt ja Zeitreise, nicht wahr? Nein, fünf, drei, fünf. Sieht irgendwie final aus. Ja, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Schade. Wer weiß, vielleicht hat das ja nicht geändert. Ich bezweifle es zwar, aber. You locked it, dumbass. <lacht> oh, das war vielleicht gar nicht so dumm. Den schreibe ich mir jetzt auf. 8, 7, 8, 9, 7, 8, 0, 8. Ach, komm schon. Sieben. Das hätten sie ein bisschen einfacher zu bedienen machen können. Geht wahrscheinlich besser mit einem Gamepad. Ah! Haha. Ha. Ähm. Sieben, acht, neun. Sieben, acht, null, acht. Oh ja! Yeah! Let's find out what Nathan Prescott has been trying to hide. What up? Need the G. Okay, cool. But you sold me water, asshole. Calm down, bring it to me. Bring it. Stay away, pigs on the beach. I have keine Ahnung, wer hier mit wem redet. Das ist. Ich habe echt keine Ahnung. Yes. This is all about Nathan trying to score for the Vortex Club party. Hmm. Ja schön, wenn ich ich bin gerade zu blöd rauszufinden, wer mit wem redet. Nathan was jonesing hard the night of the party. He didn't have enough drugs. Ist das immer Nathan? Ach, was sage ich? Ist das immer Frank? Hmm. Drug dealer drama. Ich 
Okay, rechts ist auf jeden Fall eine... Ich schätze, das ist jedes Mal Frank, mit dem er redet. You're out of control. <lacht> so it was you. Now I can officially call you a psycho stalker. Ja, okay. Damit haben wir ja fast gerechnet. Is this from Nathan's father? That's brutal. Please do not contact me at work. I've told you this before and that and being high is not an excuse anymore. This is a business. This is a business, not just a hobby. You want me to treat you like an adult who can scheiß Staubsauger. Oh well. I can see you know how to rock that big board. Take a breath, Max. Go through all this data and you can find out where Nathan took Kate after the party. Okay. Okay. Das sieht vielversprechend aus. Entschuldigung, dass ich mit der Hand vorm Mund rede. Hm, nee. Obwohl, ach, warte mal. Datum. Das ist der vierte, zehnte. Wir suchen noch was vom... Moment. Wann nochmal? So, this oh. infamous party was the fourth. Ja. Okay, also ist das das doch. Ja, genau. Das heißt, wir suchen einfach überall nach dem 4.10. Sehe ich das richtig? Und jetzt. Was Frank meeting Nathan at the junkyard? That beach is like Frank's main office. I know Nathan wasn't looking for Bigfoot in the forest. Somebody is stocking up on gas. Why? No doubt that Nathan stays in his dorm room. So he could be hiding clues there too. Da haben wir was vom 10.4. Aber das ist nicht spät genug, oder? Oder doch? Not much out there. Das ist auch der zehnte. Äh, der vierte, meine ich. Abgelegene Hütte? Halte ich gar nicht für so, un für so unwahrscheinlich, auch weil es relativ spät war. Oh, that has to be the Prescott estate. Poor Rich Nathan. Da wird er sie garantiert nicht hingebracht haben. If Joyce knew what Nathan did to Chloe, she would fry his ass. Ich gehe echt hier von aus. Chloe, this is definitely the place. Let me dig up some more clothes here. Nope. Nothing, Max. There's nothing here. Just a shitty old barn. Let's keep searching and find out who owns this haunted barn. I'm on this. Hold on. Somebody named Harry Aaron Prescott. I'm shocked. Should we call the police? Fuck that. You know the police here are like Nathan's private security, right? That's so messed up. As you've noticed, this whole town is messed up. We can't trust anybody except each other. So we have to go out to that farmhouse by ourselves. I was afraid you'd say that. We could call Warren since he kicked Nathan's ass. It's just the two of us, nobody else. And I'm not scared at all. You have the power. I feel like we're this close to finding Rachel. We have to find her, Max. We will. But remember, my power isn't infinite. We still have to be careful. 
you here, Chloe? Yes, sir. 